Hey, welcome to Early Access Control Alpha, Beta, and Abandoned. And what we are looking at is Steam Hammer by Big Way Games. Um, this game is an abandoned pile of crap, so stay away. But uh, let's get into it a little bit more. It's being sold at $21.99. I have just purchased it. Um, I have 0.6 hours of me trying to connect to their official servers that are listed. That was the last update they did. They brought um, official servers on and it, um, yeah, they don't work. So there's no way, uh, there's no way to play this game. Um, taking a deeper look at uh, Steam Hammer, the discussion pages, there's no support page. So I've posted here and um, I don't expect to get a, any uh, response. Um, I know other people have been trying the same thing and there's absolutely no way to get a hold of these guys. So looking at what Steam Hammer is, um, it's a game that's kind of was pretty intriguing, so it still might be intriguing to people that don't um, that don't follow what's going on in development. And it's a little bit worrisome that people might continue to purchase game because it looks really good and really polished and a great experience. But obviously, it didn't pan out the way they wanted. So it launched in May 2017, and effectively, really the last response was June 2018 of saying they're putting on servers. But um, the last updating was actually last year in 2017. So. Um, there's really no way to play this game. I will prove it to you. I'll show it and you guys can see for yourself that uh, that the servers don't even connect. Um, when it comes to practice like this from developers, this is where the, when the community really needs to start pointing the finger back, especially when um, companies are, are development studios are acting in these kind of really shady ways. Um, now, I say shady because it turns out, um, I'll, we'll do a little follow-up after this, but it turns out they've been working on a new game. Um, there's some there's some back and forth about, um, no, 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 it's not the same people, but it, in, it is indeed the same people. This is um, being made by Big Way Games. It's the only splash screen you see in this game. Um, and who the developer is F, or who they have listed here, I think they're trying to pin the abandonment maybe on that, that person or that team, but... Um, it doesn't work that way. Consumers aren't exactly stupid when we don't want to be, you know, and if we're going to spend time spending our money investigating something uh, or trying to play something, chances are we're going, to, we're going to ask questions because it's well within our right to do so. So, I mean, this person posted back in October um, about this game and it turns out this game is by Big Way Games. So it's spelt uh, differently. So it's definitely a different account. So they probably just created a different, different account for it. And, um, Lo and behold, you have this this other pe group of people. They've said, no, 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 we're not the same people. We are a big way, but it, the other game was SF Team, and I don't believe that. So anyways, um, you know, a public service announcement. Um, stay away from this game. This game is, is probably going to end up the same way Steam Hammer did, and I don't know why you'd even want to support um, developers that... Uh, you know, release a project and don't tell the community anything because in the terms and agreements of Steam and how you're supposed to release on early access, it says that you gotta you gotta provide the, the players or the people or your community with a playable version. And it's not a playable version because it requires servers to play, it's online. So I need, you know, I, I can't play it and anybody buying it now can't play it. So, I mean, right then and there, it should be, um, you know, questioned by Steam, like, well, what's going on? And they should be providing us some instant feedback, knowing the fact that, yeah, that's not what they're providing. Um, also, it also says that um, you, they should be providing open lines of communication and, um, you know, they should be they should be giving you a timeline for development and all these things that are kind of in the terms and agreements of Steam early access that, especially when they point to acting in best practices and the fact that, these aren't obviously being done either. Um, that's where we can get really vocal as a community and say, hey, this is this is enough. Like, let's point the finger back at these guys and call them out and be like, you know what? This is bullshit because we can't keep falling for the same old shit. And it's making Steam's early access such an awful, awful place. And, you know, it's fine that if you don't want to finish your product and, and leave it there in the unfinished state because that's well within your rights but the thing you got to tell us is you got to communicate that you got to you've got to you got to provide that communication because that's acting in best practices it says it right in the in terms and agreements in the policy so i'm calling you out uh, big way games i hope other people are um and because this is unacceptable and this is um this is primarily why my driving force behind making games like or making videos like this is 
developers acting this way. And I'll continue to make um, videos and I'm, I've got a lot to go through. I just came through this one because uh, I was adding it to the list and sure enough, everything that people are saying is true. So if you found this video helpful um, and you know anything more about uh, these, uh, these developers or this game or any insight to it, leave me some comments below and like and subscribe and come back to see more because there are so many more games. It's insane. Um, but yeah, stay away from Steamhammer and Big Way Games. Thanks. Bye.